Friends, we in Asia have learned from disasters. A quarter century ago, only a handful of Asian nations had national disaster management institutions. Today, over 30 Asian countries have dedicated institutions leading disaster risk management efforts. After the Indian Ocean tsunami of 2004, the five worst affected countries brought in new laws for disaster risk management. In a couple of days, we will observe the first International Tsunami Awareness Day. This would be an occasion to celebrate the huge improvements we have made in tsunami early warning. In December 2004, the Indian Ocean tsunami caught us unprepared and there was no warning. We now have a fully functional Indian Ocean Tsunami Warning System. Along with its Australian and Indonesian counterparts, the Indian National Center for Ocean Information Services is mandated to issue regional tsunami bulletins. The same goes for improvements in cyclone early warning, India, if we compare the impact of cyclone events in 1999 and 2013, we can see the progress we have made. Similar progress has been made in many countries. For example, after the 1991 cyclone, the government of Bangladesh launch a large community-based cyclone preparedness program. It led to a significant reduction in loss of lives from cyclones. It is now recognized as a global best practice. This will come to I tell you, yes, they don't want the truth to come out. They're bound on the fraud. They're a fraud.